Welcome back to a brand new season of Humankind. So I've been looking forward to doing this ever since the latest updates. Well, as you can see, I've assembled a nice selection of different competitors. Mammoth Air Crit 18, Lucy, Victor, two, two Dole Classics, as well as the new one, El Katrina, from the Day of the Dead event, which was a really fantastic event. I'm looking forward to seeing where M should goes with all these new events, as well as the new DLC that's been rumored for the next few months, hopefully. So, let's have a look. Yeah, we're going to leave it a normal world. Yeah, everything looks pretty standard. Yeah, world shape. Yeah, leave it as random. That's usually a bit of fun. Yeah, 300 turns. Yeah, I like, I like that nice pace and 300 turns. Start, middle, and end. Really, really good. Um, let's boost this up to nation difficulty. Just give us a small bit of a challenge this time around. I don't know where I'm going with this Let's Play, but I'm really playing with the idea of reforging the Roman Empire. Bring the Romans from the second year all the way to the, to the last, up to the modern era. But let's see where we go from here. Without further ado, let's get into this new season of Humankind. Here is where it begins. The future that you carve through force of will and a bit of luck. Out of the raw stuff of planet Earth. Alliances and enemies, wealth and danger, power and penury. May you leave the greatest mark. Right. I really like that narrator. Absolutely brilliant job. Ooh, interesting region. Let's set this to auto explore and see what goodies we can find. Okay. Oh, found some salt. Okay. Not Just bad. because a culture died out doesn't mean it wasn't worthy of study. Oh, sanctuary right there. Burn that down for some food. Now, let's grab you. Well, it's not a bad region, actually. Three unknown strategics. She tuned this region here. Let's pop over here and have a quick look. Person. Okay, really, really good. Now. See where they would recommend. Oh, it's a really good food one. Let's grab that here. Let's get the research, and we can grab the food here. Get our second. Now, pop you out uh, and send you off on your magical adventure. We come down this way. Yeah, it's actually not a bad region. Salt, Wurzlin. Yeah, really, really good. As I said, with this new Let's Play, I'm going to... With this run... I'm going to definitely reforge the Roman Empire. Something I've really been itching to do. Some, something a bit different from the, the normal min-max, get the best culture mix all the way through. Just do something a bit different. Right, ten turns, okay. Okay, a bit more science up here. Wow. There's two more salt here. This will be a really good region. Let's grab this here. Um That's too bountiful. Grab this here. Wow. Okay. Oh. Now we're leaving the science behind, but remind me later. Stick, stick around. Yeah, let's do makers. Okay. Well turns in. Let's get the fourteen food here. It's a 
re two really really good regions right here send you off as well T absolutely tons and tons of science now Ooh. Actually, the Egyptians with the Romans, really good mix. And plus, I like the lore. Right, let's go for it. Let's become the Egyptians. Ah, the challenges of a young civilization. It's hard keeping up with the neighbors when they have the wheel and you don't. Humankind learns quickly that everyone contributes. If you're terrified of wild animals, you can grow lentils or catch fish. Tribes settle towns. Towns develop markets, and markets begin the exchange of goods, services, and most important, rumors and hearsay. Entering this era as the Egyptians, then? No prizes for guessing how you plan to leave your mark. Yeah. No. It is not just a bunch of buildings. It is warmth, protection, and, praise the gods, a bit of privacy. There we go. Let's get our Egyptian pyramids going. Now, are we horses? No. What we do need is artisan quarters. So taking advantage of all our different resources here, like salt person. Two more salt down here. Wow. We're going to absolutely between our industrial base and our food base. We're going to actually really, really good start as a roll. When we go in as the Romans. Now let's flip the turn. Actually, it'd be a good idea actually to. Hmm. Right over here, saffron. Salt here. More salt. Actually, this region here would be really important for us. Let's grab you. And you come up this way. Let's get domestication going. Porcelain first. Let's get some money. Really, really good. You have built a first outpost, adding another territory to your empire. Let's I know it. you're hoping this is the beginning of something very, very big. Yeah, let's grab everything we can. Wow, this is actually a really interesting region. Really, really interesting start. Really interesting looking world as well. I like to send the send it to random just to see what we get. But it's actually quite not bad at all. Oh. The agrarian harapans. You're as likely to meet their canals and farmers as their soldiers. Life is wonderful, is it ah, not? Katrina, her friends, okay. Treat me and my people with respect. Let's and offer you a trade. Well. Gladly. Brilliant. No. Let's get our unit back before you kill us. Let's do a cartman trade. Now, how much would the next outpost? 74. Two the turns. first visible mark of this new culture. I hope the style is pleasing, Let's get because here. it will be around for as long as the city lasts. Let's get back. There we go. Now we finish our first pyramid. Let's do city growth and really get going. Now city defenses. Over this way. Let's have a look. Just look in this region. Let's pop over this region first. We set up another outpost. Over this way. Oh, it's more salt here. Okay. Let's get you back. Now, another maker's quarters right there. 
And a farmer's quarters there. So we just kind of farm a region here. Let's finish that up. Perfect. Now. To pop around here. Hmm. Let's sort. Whoa. 28 right there. Perfect. Get back that curiosity in a moment. Now you've got our danger. Let's see you come up and along this coastline here. Bountiful. Prosperous. Let's go bountiful. Let's harvest. Now... That's going to be a fantastic outpost for our capital. Now, you come with me. Pop over here. No sign of horses. Okay. Hmm. That's what we def desperately need. No. Right. here you got this curiosity now let's do irrigation now let's touch here Set the balance now. Now, founding mitt. Let's go. Why was this even a question? Let's keep it simple. We've been here. Let's go. It's our place. Get to now. Posts. Look down here. No, no lucky yet. How about she? Any luck finding horses? No. Let's finish off this. Wow. Thirteen twenty-one. Really good place for a second city. Let's set you off to auto explore. And you. Ooh, we're doing really, really well. Really well, actually. Let's pop you up. Um, let's silence the witnesses. Okay, I know we're small bit broke, but we found some money. Now, I have to find the horses here. You come with me, and let's set up an outpost here. Here, and... Oh, it's going to... Here, here, and here. Maybe. And for a second city, 160. Yeah, that's the next turn.
Let's set up a warrior. You come with me and we'll set up an outpost down here. Hey, what's this? An encampment. Look over here. Let's burn that down. Exactly setting the world on fire down here, but let's grab you here. It's locking down these two regions. Now let's come down here. We'll turn you into a second city in a moment. Whoa! Let's go for shamanism. Yeah, let's lock down this region. Grab his curiosity along the way. Now grab this. And this. Now. First things first. Let's grab this here. Let's make a really good farming region. Let's go for bronze working. Get access to bronze dead. Oh. Curiosity right there. Pause here. Perfect. Now, a few go. And you're coming over here. Wow, this is actually really kind of really, really tough because there's so much room for us to expand. You don't want to expand too quickly either. Like any 4x game, expand too quickly, leave yourselves open to attack from everywhere. Yeah, let's grab here. Now, put our second city here, unlock these two together here. Well, we're going to have plenty of food anyway. No shortage. Now we'll finish bronze working. Let's get the wheel. Let's grab that here. And let's grab this curiosity. And let's sit you off to auto explore again. And we need 160. Now, you grab this here. Wow. So, first things first, need 230, 160, turn you into the city, don't we? Wow. Let's finish this off. We're already going to the next era. That's crazy. Well, maybe in a moment. Whoa. We already have the two ahead of us. Okay. Now. This is interesting.
do we w hold on? So these are the Babylonians. Oh. It can only be an advantage to have a neighbor. Hey, you folks. Oh. Heartfelt greeting. The Babylonians. This is where Probably I 18. greet you. Impress upon you the wonder of my people. Do you want a trade? Perfect. Hi, Katrina. Wondering if you're a partner or an impediment. Oh. Oh, great. Blue hole here, okay. From the second city. And let's get one Egyptian pyramid up. No. Bring you back. Wow. That's actually a really, really good start. Not a bad start at all. Bloody and smelly, aren't they? Oh. History may be changed by battles, but that doesn't mean they're enjoyable. Who are we fighting against? Oh, two archers. Um, let's get the head out of there. <laughs> our scouts can... No way our scouts can deal with two archers. Yeah, let's get them back home as quickly as they can. Now... It's a touch here. Let's get two pyramids up at least. And with our capital city... Hmm... Let's get a stone ring going. Not at the moment. No, let's see how we're doing with flame wise. Let's wait one more turn in this era. Let's Other this empires pyramid. are nervously wondering what is being built with those five makers. Yeah, we're not going to hopefully not miss out. Let's keep this warrior here. And let's bring the scout home as well. Now we've just queued up. Perfect. Now, now is a good time to transcend. Right. Bit of a crash there for a moment. That was strange. The whole thing just froze up there. Hmm. Kind of all the bugs have been ironed out. But anyway, every game has them. So, as I was saying, now we're going to adopt the Roman Empire and reforge it into a world domination power now to the end of the modern era. As urban centers grow, both ideas and sewage are generated at a record pace. Arts and sciences flourish as military tactics and mathematical equations become as coveted as physical goods. Empires struggled to control these intangibles, however, as some might trouble their stability. Though the Romans did indeed appreciate intangibles, I might be tempted to say that their most famous creation was their legions, definitely, which were very tangible Definitely was indeed. their legions. Definitely was their legions. So, that was a weird crash there when I, a while ago. Right. Now that we're the Romans, we have access here to try, to the arch. Really, really a fantastic building. There's plenty of stability across the board. That means we can have far more regions, far more districts than anyone else. Now, let's finish off this. 13. 13. Okay. And let's touch you here. Now. So, first, let's get the horses done. Perfect. No. And uh, let's get the pottery workshop up. Get more influence. Perfect. It's going really, really well. Now, we've locked down a nice, nice region here for ourselves. Alright, we need 430 for here.
And this brought we we brought you back for a reason. But gonna attach here and here. Nice. Let's pop up. Oh, more horses up here. Okay. Let's have a look around. Right. Hmm. It's a lair right there as well. Okay. Really, really weird. Right. And an independent people. So, some nice people to expand to. Not bad at all. Now, seeing that we have defense around our capital, let's see, let's lock down this entire region, these two cities, and then just conquer everyone else. Let them do all the build up the infrastructure and so on. We'll just map it up. Now, let's have a look around here along this coastline. What is iron up here? Right there, brilliant. That'll come in really handy. Now, where are our famous legions? Right there. So first, let's do organized war for it, and then go standing armies. Wow. Okay. Do you want a treaty? You should listen to this. There we go, Lucy. Now, we need 430. Okay. Fantastic end. Wow, this is getting really, really good. This is a really good start as the Roman Empire. Locked down a nice, sizable region. Locked down this one of these areas up here. We can actually have a fantastic coastal. Show me here. Yeah, that's actually really good here. Found now post right there. We have access to the coastline. As well as salt. Oh. Hello. Oh, two angry bears. Let's do a manual battle. Yes. Off we go. Put our warriors up front. Right, really angry bears. Right, let's kill them off there. Let's pull you back and let the bear attack the warriors. Right, end around. Okay. Kill the bear again. Okay. Really, really good. Good battle there. Hold. Now. Really good city. Really well balanced. Thebes is really good. Yeah, let's grab that there. And... Grab that. Perfect. Now it costs us a bit of influence, but it's well worth it. Now. Let's set this outpost up here. This would be, that should be a really good region to set up. Actually, set up Rome along the coast. That should be a really good idea. So what we're serving in now is influence. Now, yeah, let's have a look. Let's set up some defences in our second city as well. Have you defend here? No. Let's go. Off you go. Let's have a look around. So many 510. Wow. Or 30. Yeah, I have a feeling I think they, they definitely quick the influence. Oh. Can we... Unknowledged. Acknowledged. 
So, let's have a look. Ooh, food, science. Let's claim the temp pyramid of Giza. Well, that'll be interesting, unlocking processions. Organized warfare is done. Let's get standing army so we can unlock our Praetorian Guard. Wow. It's really, really good. Do you mind us sitting up here, I wonder? Yeah, set up another outpost. Yeah, let's get as many outposts set up as we can. We can expand without using weapons. Wow. Now let's claim this territory right here on the border. Let's lock down as many places as we can. Yeah, let's protect. No. So much good harbors there. Let's get ammo barns done. Another maker's quarters. And farming. Actually, let's do farming first and keep our growth going. Now, let's have a look at our Campbell City here. Nearly done as well. Now, we need somewhere, no somewhere good for our pyramids. Right there. So it looks really well. Actually, let's get both our cities involved in this one. So, we'll lock down another outpost here. Let's come up and along. Yeah, we're really locking down er everywhere. This is a really good start of the Romans. Really, really good start. We're really rocking and rolling as they say now. For no. both of our aspirations. Does he want a non aggression this pack? Works. You have no butter. No. Any good place? Actually, where we're standing right now. Right. There we go. That's that. Now. This has been a really, really good start so far. Really, really good. Really happy with this, actually. We've locked down a nice region all around our capital of Memphis here. Which, we are, or change our capital, of course, to Rome as soon as we found the Roman city. So, yeah, there we go. Um, let's you stay there and guard that just in case. Actually, this would best be a good place to set up Rome. Nice defensible city. Or here. Hmm. Actually, we're setting up Rome here would be really, really good. Really, really good. Actually, let's have a look at our civics. Religious rights. Gathering, sharing, forming Leadership. a community. Might I recommend throwing in a few feasts as Let's well? get the plus one city capital as well. Plus one city cap. So at least we can do three cities without too much penalties. Well, there's not much penalties. It's usually just influence costs, but it's not too bad. Plus, we'll have our second city soon enough anyway, in the next turn. Now, about 65 turns in. Where are we do Completing our first wonder. This, this oh. is something you need to see. Katrina picked the Celts. Okay, Perhaps. interesting. This works. You Let's hope that we don't have to repeat history of the Romans and wipe, and try to wipe out the Celts. Ah, brilliant! Finish our standing army. Yeah, 
Uh, and our new wonders has been done. The Pyramids of Giza. Ah, uh, fantastic. The original construction yardstick by which all other projects will be measured. Absolutely brilliant. And we have access to iron. Plenty of iron, actually. Two iron mines. Ah, fantastic. On that brilliant note, I'm going to call today's episode. What a brilliant start as the Roman Empire. Set up nice regions all the way around. The next episode, we're going to be setting up Rome itself here. And right next to our former capital of Memphis, we're going to transfer the capital, of course, obviously to Rome. So, on that exciting note, I'm going to call today's episode. And as always, thank you very much for watching this season of Humankind.